Hello YouTube. I wanted to answer a couple of questions a few of you have had uh, asking about linking together more than one rain barrel. Um, this is how I do it. There's a couple of them here. This is called a manifold system. And you'll see down there two pipes connecting into this horizontal pipe and we have a third one down here and that's how they're connected now that's a 55 gallon drum technically turned upside down those threaded holes should already be there if you have a closed top barrel by creating this manifold system the water is shared between all three barrels at once so when we turn on this valve and we're running the irrigation system we have access to all three barrels at the same time not just one barrel so they self level as water comes into one barrel say this one here it runs out the pipe and this way and when it hits down there to those barrels the water will just go up from the pipes down here up until they reach the same level inside the barrels. So if there's 12 inches of water in the first barrel, give it a minute and you'll probably have like 10 inches of water after they settle. So I hope that clears things up for a few of you. This here is a valve that I've got on the manifold system and that allows me to isolate this barrel from the next barrel in the line. So basically what I can do is I can shut off two of these barrels and only run off of one barrel if I want to. I do that sometimes in the summer just in case I forget to turn it off. I'll uh, still have a good supply of water. Otherwise if I've got all three of the barrels turned on and something happens and I walk away, I'm going to come back and have three empty barrels and it might take a week or more for it to rain. So it's just a way to make kind of a reserve thing. Also if there were ever to be a, a break in the plumbing or some kind of breach, then hopefully you could get out here and, and shut off your tanks before they're all empty and you'd at least have some kind of water left. After you make your repairs you'd not be completely dry. You can see another valve on the other end down there. Okay, so I hope that clears anything up. If you have any more questions or comments, uh, leave them in the box and I'll respond to them as quick as I can. Thanks. Bye-bye.